Ah, okay, bees. Bush. Back to the mansion. Hmm. Okay, we can do this. Dirty Feather Duster. A wrapper, drunk change. I've got a lot of crap here. I'm not even sure what half of this does. Lots of walk yeah. Lots of walking about in this. Are you gonna do anything for me, squirrel? Alright, that's it. Now you'll get what you deserve. I'm gonna insult you until I get that nut. You ugly squirrel, you. Don't you know it's not politically correct to wear fur? Thanks! Always a solution. I won't find the nut just like that if the grass is too dense. Okay, can't use the... I thought maybe you could use the desk fan. Although we can still use the fan here. That still looks weird. Excuse me, lady, but I think your laundry is dry now. And too much sun will distort the clothes. How come the laundry dried out so fast? I'd better go and check it. You are right, young man. Thank you. You're welcome. Ah, uh, you don't know how to talk to girls, but... Would you like some candy? You're nice, but no. Thanks, I don't want to get fat. Don't worry, even Obelix has friends. Who's Obelix? Uh, never mind. It's just that I found this candy. You found it? I found it pretty hard to get, of course. It's not some pseudo-cheap... Highest quality. Oh, alright, if you insist. Um, I think I should give you something in return. Oh no, you really don't have to. Okay, your wish. Well, on second thoughts. I knew it, you, you boys always want something. You can't do anything for free. I cleaned my room once. Uh, let's forget it. Here's my present for you. It's my ribbon. Think of me sometimes. Thanks, I'll never wash it. Oh, cool. Could really ruin my life. Okay, just take the rope. Where did I get a rake? I tie a ribbon around the rake, narrow it. Ah, okay, and we we'll use this on the grass, which will get the nut. See, some of this stuff... Um, jumps. I need... I, I need to keep checking the guide, because... I'm, I'm just keep running out. I keep running out of ideas. 
Okay, so I've got the plastic apple. The only thing I can think of now is to go back to the mansion. There it is. Hey, little buddy. I've got a decent proposal for you. A big, fresh, juicy apple for this old cone which presses your back. If you want to make a deal, stand there and shake your muzzle. He wants the deal. I didn't like that. Life is brutal. Painted potato. Hmm. At least it's gone. One small step for man, one big pain in the head. Meanwhile, in the mansion. So, we've been informed that later. I'm busy right now. As you wish, sir. Hey, let go, will you? Oops. Meanwhile, in the mansion. Sir, some young boy tried to get inside the mansion. Don't worry. Young boys are curious. And my house plays on their imaginations. But keep an eye on him. Yes, sir. shovel. Hundred moments later. <laughs> that's... that's... I'm guessing they're, mo they're moles. At least I found crude oil and I'll be rich. That's my life. Meanwhile, in the mansion. So that boy tried to get in again. Do you think it's serious? No, he doesn't look dangerous. But maybe we should... Nah. Just keep him out of the mansion. But tell me if he appears again. Now get back to our job. Your job. Get in there. Let's try bribing him. What would you say if I gave you some gold? I'd say thanks. Would you let me in? I guess so. You'd have to be sure. Okay, I'm sure I will let you in. Alright, here we go. Now please open the door. No way, now buzz off. Hey, I gave you gold, remember? What gold? <laughs> you said you'd let me in. But you've let me down. Yeah, but I'll let you off. You can't even trust corrupt guards these days. Meanwhile, in the mansion. Don't tell me it's that boy again. I'm afraid so. The guards say the boy's really desperate. 
He's starting to get on my nerves. What am I paying you for? Should I... Not yet. Let's give him a last chance. Hmm. Okay. Let's combine that with that. And then that with that. Where's he gone? I made a dot. Yeah, let's use that on that. That's a big bear. Life is really brutal. <laughs> Meanwhile, in a mansion. Sir, let me guess. The boy? Bingo. Why do I have to do everything? Can't you do anything yourself? Shall I kill him or just beat him to pieces? You're stupid. There are better ways. I'll handle it myself. Now get out. I have to change my clothes. That's a... look at that hat. That's amazing. The way he smokes a cigar. Are you Mr. John Notty? How do you do, my friend? My people told me you tried to get inside my mansion. Why? Uh, you see, I'm here to... to I mean, I'm here on my vacations, but I got sick of all these green plants and trees around. I just wanted to lick some civilization. Well, I can understand you, my friend. I also think that the natural environment for us people of the 20th century is TV and a bag of popcorn. But talking about the green stuff, I can't allow you to enter my house because uh, it's being under renovation, but as a rich man, I'll give you a hundred bucks. So you can buy yourself something that will help you survive here. A Walkman, for example. Walkman, that's so 90s. <laughs> what do you take me for? Here, let me make your pocket fat. I will never take this. Never! Don't get so excited. Now, I'll leave now. Don't be shy and pick up the banknote. No one has to know. Goodbye, my friend. Can't believe he treated me like that. By the way, peculiar non omelette. I'm really proud I didn't take that. I'm a pathetic little wimp. Ah, oh. oh, well, I know someone who will want this. Hello, Anne. If I just show her the money, she might take it. Oh. Let's put it on the table. Yeah. Oh, it's a note for some bank. Strange, but someone has also written Never Anne on it. I found your name on a banknote some fats they gave me. Do you know anything about it? Show me the banknote. Hey, what's up? Oh, poor me. Why are you crying? This, this, oh poor me. 
Our neighbour, Mr. John Notty, gave me some money one day. He said that if I gave him a kiss, he'd give me more. But I fought it over, and I gave him all the money back. You mean that pig tried to buy you? I'm so unhappy. Oh man, that does it. A hundred bucks. I want blood. <laughs>